in the ICC opened on a positive territory today on a positive note today after the sharp drop later on last trading session of last so now what to expect today from nasdaq 100 dow jones dax and futsi 100 in the same sequence we are going to look at first is we'll start with tech 100 do watch till the end also press the bell icon which keeps you updated with the twice a day analysis the next update will be released before the us session and please do like share subscribe and comment that's always a great motivation let's start also you can remain updated by joining my free telegram channel the link is mentioned in the channel and video description see nasdaq 100 if you look at it has formed a peak here after this retracement and now trying to consolidate a bit uh the up move may resume you can see these four candles here getting little resistance here at 15370 and 15380 zone so yes you can buy here at 15380 however 15400 420 my favorite and beyond 15420 15450 level so till 15450 it has got very very good resistance beyond that it will try to fly now see if you look at the hourly charts what it has done almost flat bottom and higher high so rise retracement so it can follow a second uh, rise formation here it can try to rise a bit from here we have to just look at these levels 15400 420 if it stays above this more bullishness may prevail here now see stock icc on the early charts is overbought that is why we can see little red candles there the macd is trying to cross over for a buy while rsi is almost trading flat here coming to two hour charts on the two hour charts similar formation here see a uh, drop retracement then drop but it failed to bridge below the previous lows here that is very very important we have already discussed why 15200 is a very important level it is not yet breached those levels now on the upside now also if you look at moving averages are trading with divergence and the prices are also divergent from the moving average so the possibility for it to hit 50 period is also there which means 15450 levels the stock has stick rising macd crossing over for a buy rsi almost flat coming to 3 likewise on the 3 hour charts uh see this is important to note and then higher highs are important to note so right now also it is trying to retrace a little and hence probably you can buy here at 15380 but need to be very very cautious alert 15450 is the a uh, good resistance 15420 is also a resistance and hence you have to put your stop loss at your entry price and remember we have entire day in front of us it can also hit 15500 as well what we have seen drop retracement double bottom and if it could rise we will see a big bullish move here stock is rising macd divergent and bullish the macd has got lot much for, of scope for it to rise rsi flat while on the 4 hour charts if you look at on the 4 hour charts see a second green candle after this reversal sign we can expect a third green candle if it stays above 15380 420 450 cannot be denied stock is rising macd crossing over this is important macd crossing over for a buy i will wait for the divergence it should not happen what has happened here hence this time it may try to pull the price a little up rsi flat coming to the daily chart on the daily charts an important formation here is see higher lows are seen and higher high so see after this sharp drop here just let me show after this sharp drop here four to five red candles it is trying to show a little retracement which suggests see what has happened here is the drop from here then the retracement this is the first wave now second wave is beginning second wave might might pull the prices little up till towards this zone in few sessions maybe two or three sessions maybe little more but right now it is on the path of a little retracement on the upside stock is stick is oversold macd is divergent and bearish and if you look at rsi is also now looking upwards considering this you can buy at 15380 and a sell entry is only below 15300 where one can expect 250 200 as the next support below 200 more bearishness may prevail above 450 is where the bulls will try to take the charge we can see more bullishness above 15 450 levels take your positions accordingly now let's have a look at dow jones and before we proceed if you want to learn this art of trading you should join my mentorship batch 24th batch is starting today reach out to me for more details my telegram and email ids are mentioned in the channel and video description see us 30 and us 100 both have almost similar formation here if you count this move from 35500 to 35050 it is almost 450 points if you uh, if you ask for the median or 50% retracement of this move, 
you will find 35 to 75 35 300 levels so there is a very strong probability that us 30 may try to strike these levels once again that is 35 300 levels now if it is possible today or not let's see see on the early chart there is a slight reversal sign we are seeing here and hence uh, i will recommend you to buy if you see us 30 trading above 35 200 we are then we can look forward to a target at 35 300 levels so 35 200 is a good buying entry stock i stick was over what it is trying to drop macd willing to converge crossover for a buy entry rsi is almost trading flat here coming to two hour charts similar observation here nothing different only thing is that the prices are divergent a little bit more from the moving averages and it missed it must try to converge uh stochastic rising macd is bearish trying to converge rsi is flat coming to three hour charts similar observation here also and we can possibly look forward to these levels stochastic is rising here the macd is bearish trying to converge rsi is flat same observation on the four hour charts i'll wait for the next candle if it stays above 200 certainly it will look forward to this zone stochastic here is also oversold macd is bearish and rsi is flat so yes the scope for uh retracement the scope for a rise exists here on the charts for us 30 as well what we had looked in for us 100 see higher lows here possibility for it to retrace here exists strong and if you look at in fact even if it has to drop three red candles a little bit of retracement 35 300 400 and then further drop later can be one move which we can expect yes also here if it is bullish it is already taken the support from to 20 period moving average and i will definitely watch out for how it behaves here stock stochastic on the daily charts is divergent bearish probably a little convergence can be expected rsi is was overbought and hence it has seen a, a drop there considering this i will recommend you to buy at 200 and expect it to retrace for 35 300 350 400 levels also on the downside i will recommend you to sell here at only at 35 100 levels below which you can expect 35 0, 5, 0, 35 000, and then 34 9 20 34 800 levels will be the next targets take your positions accordingly now let's have a look at dax if you look at DAX, it DAX fallen into the support zone till towards 14700, 800 and since then has retraced. If you look at the formation, higher lows are consistently seen and the flat top suggestive of that 16000 anyways, we know that it is a great, great resistance. However, I will be looking forward for it to break past by this. Yes, you can buy here at 15,900 levels. You can buy here at 15,900 20 levels rather see this zone is what i am looking forward to if it breaks past this zone is where the bulls will try to take over so rather you can buy at 15 9 20 levels expect 940 960 980 and then 16000 so 20 points trailing stop loss till 16000 or rather i will say 16000 20 levels yes it may try to achieve those levels if it stays above 15 9 20 the stock stick is trying to trade with little bullishness here rsi is almost flat on the two hour charts if you look at on the two hour chart see a uh, on the two hour charts another observation see drop retracement drop lower lows retracement the highs of this channel are somewhere here at around 15 950 levels the lows are at around 750 i will recommend to buy at 920 so that you can uh, expect see this time it may try to break past this zone uh, or a little further upwards move can be expected here stock isic rising macd has crossed over trading with divergence it has completed i think first cycle or maybe it can stretch a bit on the upside so we'll wait for it to cross over for a confirmation of a second sell wave rsi flat coming to three r chart similarly on the three r chart see there is a gap there higher lows are seen certainly higher lows are giving it a very very good support here on the downside be careful for 15 840 levels below which you can try to initiate a sell for 15 800 and below levels stock stochastic rising macd bullish rsi flat on the four r charts if you look similar observation lower highs yes prices are still divergent from the moving average which it may try to converge till possibility exists for this also stochastic rising macd crossing over for a buy rsi flat coming to the daily charts likewise on the daily chart see previous two candles lower lows if you count lower highs this is where the expense expense of this belt is so 15 950 15 7 
50 levels this is where the complete expansion exists yes this is a bearish channel however there is a possibility of a retracement only sell entry i will recommend is below 15840 where you can expect 800 800 780 is a very very good support zone if it breaks below this that is where the bears will take over the charge the stock stochastic divergent macd divergent and bearish it can possibly converge from here RSI stock I stick oversold RSI is almost flat considering this for the day I will recommend you to buy at 920 15920 levels till 16,020 you have to put a 20 point trailing stop loss chances for it to achieve 16,020 16,100 exist within this week itself on the downside 15,840 you can sell and below 15,840 is where more bears will try to take over the moment there and then you can expect 800 780 at the maximum support levels below that a crash again take your positions accordingly now let's have a look at FTSE 100 now see UK 100 on the early charts has given a slight gap up here 7520 7500 7480 now very very strong support levels 7520 is definitely a very good support only below 7520 we can initiate a sell entry but then till 7500 480 it has got extremely good support only and only if you see FTSE 100 or UK 100 below 7480 stay short and it is going to crash again. If you look at the moving average, they have started to converge. The prices have also converged till towards the moving average. Now, also if you look at 7560 is a great resistance above which only further bullishness may prevail. Stock has taken near to overbought levels. MACD is also in green and at zero levels. RSI rising. Coming to two hour charts, similar, similar observation here drop retracement drop and it is back in this channel i will wait whichever direction it tries to take from here stock i stick rising macd is bullish rsi is looking up and on the three hour chart similar observation uh, and hence we have to wait for 7520 at least on the downside and 7560 on the upside even if you are buying at 7560 till 7600 7600 is an extremely good resistance stock i stick flat macd trying to trade with divergence and bullishness rsi is also trying to look upwards coming to four similar observation and here the crossover has happened at a little later level and see this is divergent this is still suggestive of bullishness here rsi is looking upwards and on the daily charts if you look at on the daily charts the previous two candles are very very important you can see it is given you higher lows higher highs and the prices are also still little divergent from the moving average is sitting at around 7560 7580 zone and then till 7600 possibility of a retracement exists now see if you look at the moment four sharp red candles it can try to retrace a little on the upside till towards this zone which is 764050 even if it has to drop the stock is stick uh, at bottom there MACD divergent and bearish it can converge a bit RSI is looking upwards considering this I will recommend you to buy at 7560 sell at 7520 for for this 40 points we are not going to trade on the upside we have to be watchful alert for 7680 levels and uh, 7580 7600 levels two levels are very very important and if it stays above certainly you can expect 764050 zone on the downside Till 7480, we have to be alert. Below 7480 is where the bears will take the prices till towards 7450, 7400 levels. Take your positions accordingly. Trade with a stop loss. Trade with a tailing stop loss. Do like, share, subscribe, and comment. Join my mentorship by joining my signals channel. Reach out to me for any of your trading or training queries. My telegram and email IDs are mentioned in the channel and video description. Thank you very much. See you again before the US session. Thank you.